Welcome back to the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking program. Today is Kids Day. Today we're gonna make it so you can make yourself some nice, lovely kids dinner at home. Kids meal is just beautiful and really nice. This one, adults can also have it, but it's a kids meal. I'm just making for kids that you can prepare this at home for kids. We're not gonna use any salt inside of this recipe. It's gonna be bland, plain and straight, straightforward, guys. Just to make the kids them healthy, cut back on salt and sugar. And that's our key on our pie for 2016. So guys, look forward for all of these tips and ideas which are gonna come up for you. Hopefully you will enjoy the recipe. Get a copy of my cooking book and Amazon. The price won't change, it's your price. So thank you so much for subscribing to the channel and leaving your comments. It's amazing to see that, guys. See you next time, bye-bye. Right here I have some potato inside of the board. If you notice, I cut on the potato, I'm already remove the skin and I peel them off. Right here I have some sachets, so it's gonna be mashed potato and, and sachets. Right here I have some pork sachets and I have two, four, six, eight, ten, ten pieces sachets. I just roasted off some sachets in the oven. Basically, you can get sachets at any local shop, supermarket, on the high street, wherever you go, you can get these things to buy, guys. And all you're gonna do, simple, lay them out in the tray and a piece of grease proof paper like this and bang put your gas mark at gas seven or eight and you're gonna roast them off in the oven for 20 25 to 30 minutes um the potato we're gonna boil off the potato and i'm gonna show you how to boil off the potato and mash it and also you're gonna serve it some red onion gravy if not you can just serve it with some red onion on top of it if you don't like gravy so right here no salt that's the main thing we're gonna focus on this already, um, you know, I mean, there's no salt in this, such as they come natural, homemade it. Um, so, right here, we're gonna put this in the oven for half an hour. This one, we're gonna cook off this for half an hour, so roughly four to five minutes. Probably everything will take to an hour. Enjoy the recipe, guys. Lovely and nice. To cook off your potato, the best thing is to wait till the water starts to get boiled like that. After you peel your potato and cut them up, take a little time and put them in just like this. Be careful, don't burn yourself. That's health and safety. Don't burn yourself. Not gonna put any salt inside of it. We're just gonna boil it off just like that, guys. Um, then simple. Just cover it and leave it for roughly about 20 to 25 minutes and it, until it gets soft. And then we're gonna mash it. Enjoy the recipe. Thank you so much. Yes, potato finished, done and dusted. When you wanna know your potato soft, it just mash off a part away. Anyway, what we're gonna do now? We're gonna get them the potato mashed up. First of all, we're gonna add some some butter towards it, guys. Large spoon of butter. Put a little bit more. And then also a little bit of milk, all the milk. Nice one. This is the kids lunch or you know what I mean what you wanna call it guys dinner or you whatever you wanna call it but this is really good so first of all that's gonna have a simple mashed up like this I know you guys are gonna love this recipe simple recipe it's mashed potato and such is others do love this too some people call it, they call it by that name Bang Bang. Really nice, really, really good nice guys, as you can see, looking lovely. A nice creamy and looking lovely. So now this is finished. Now we're gonna check out the, the sachets and see how they look. And if they're ready, we will share with the food. If not, cover this and rest it into your microwave. Make it keep warm until such is ready. Enjoy it. I love the 
So right here, I'm just sauteing up some white red onion to put on the sauces. So as you can see, looking lovely and nice. For you to kill the strength of the white red onion, because red onion is a strong, very strong. So you can make your eye run even water. Is put a little bit of sugar or salt on it, and it will do help to kill the, 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 the onion. So I'm just taking out some red onion also to put on it. Enjoy the recipe, guys. I just take them from the oven, guys, and as you can see, though, they're looking lovely and nice. These are the yummy, yummy suches, guys. Kids love suches and mashed potato, otherwise, I'm calling it bang bang. So, here it is, finish. Now we're gonna share it up. Enjoy the recipe today from Chef Ricardo. Nice and lovely. To share out a nice, lovely meal like this, guys. I know, you know what I mean? Others do love it also. But basically, what you can do at home if you're sharing for you're cooking for a lot of family, you know what I mean? You can put a piece of a clean flame over the spoon for you to take up your mashed potato. And then what happened now? Look at this. That's the way how it will come out looking lovely and nice all right then next thing what we're gonna do is simple guys we have some broccoli right here which I have a video for the broccoli differently guys I have it on my YouTube channel simple put some broccoli right here some people like gravy with it but for me honestly I don't like so much gravy around my food I mean so as you can see this is exactly what I'm talking about I want you guys to see definitely what we're talking about right here and then next thing is simple you can put some red onion on top of it like this if you want to make some gravy you can make gravy and add on here one at home but I would just have it just like this you know I mean natural and you know affecting you know, that's fantastic looking lovely so as you can see basic recipe mashed potato such as and red onion with some broccoli kids love this kind of meal and others do love this kind of meal also so enjoy the recipe and subscribe to the channel and see you next time bye bye